नमस्ते लेडीज एंड जेंटल एज अ पार्ट ऑफ रिक्वेस्ट एंड यू नो वेदर यू से इट एज रिक्वेस्ट वेदर यू से इट एज मोटिवेशन वॉट एवर इट इज वॉट एवर दैट I have been doing so far this video recordings or uh, whatever you say you know I also need certain kind of motivation at first place and secondly I am doing it because I wanted to give it back to the society I also spent lot of time and burn more energy as well just give that small bit of it or the you know, small part you know where you know if you could really think that yes whatever he is telling let's try listening to it and give that small bit of support it could be cash or kind or whatever it is if you can donate small bit of it my channel would be really thankful to you and i would be able to produce much better results it's a request and i also commit mistake and mistakes as well i am also normal human being please do correct if you think that i have committed mistake i am telling wrong at any place please do correct me you can always call me on my phone number 9121379100 this is what is my gpay number as well and the phone pay number also is the same if you see though i am sharing those details with you and in case if you have any suggestions or questions please feel free to send it across to the email address of n a r a d l a r a m a c h a n d r a at the rate yahoo.com or simple smith123846 at the rate gmail.com small part of donation whether it is cash whether it is kind whether it is help or whatever it is will really motivate individuals like me to do videos like this i appreciate your patience i thank again for watching my videos in advance please do like subscribe share stay blessed have a real blissful life may the guru's grace be with all have a nice day ahead
नमस्ते लेडीज एंड जेंटल अस्य श्री शुद्ध शक्ति माला महामंत्र उपस्थइंद्रियादि वरुण आदित्य ऋषि दैवी गायत्री छंद सात्विक कक्कार हट्टारिक पीठस्थित श्रीमत्कामेशरांक निलया श्रीमत्कामेशरी देवता ऐं बीज क्ली शक्ति सौ कीलक श्रीदेवी प्रीतर्थे खड्क सिद्ध्यर्थे चपे विनियोग ऐं बीज क्ली शक्ति सौ कीलक श्रीदेवी प्रीतर्थे गुरुर्ब्रह्म गुरुर्विष्णु गुरुर्देव महेशर गुरुर्साक्षात्म ब्रह्म तस्म श्री गुरव नम अज्ञानिनामरांध से ज्ञानाजनशलाकया चक्षुरमीत तस्म श्री गुरव नम नौ अगेन एज ए से this invoking is all about to make sure that uh, you know whatever that we are speaking goes in a right direction by seeking guru you are that brahman consciousness you are that you are everything in this world shrimat kameshwari devata you are that kameshwari devata दैवी गायत्री छंदा गायत्री माता मई नमस्कार गायत्री देव नाउ देर टू विजन्स दैट वन नीड्स दैट हैपेंस while in the transformation or transformation phase at a conscious level of the human existence at macro and micro level macro cosmic cosmic energy level and micro cosmic energy level and to get connected to this level in saptaswaras धनी स धनी स धनी 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 स स प स धनी 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 स म प स धनी 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 ध प ध प प ध प धनी 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 ध प ध प ध प ध प धनी धनी ध ध ध ध धनी धनी ध प धनी नि स निसरे धप धप निसरे धप 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 धनी 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 धप 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 धनी 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 सधनी धनी 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 निसरे 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 गम का धप 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 धनी 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 सनी स धनी सा 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 धा पा धा पा सा धा पा धनी धा पा धनी 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 धा पा धा पा धा पा धा पा धा पा धा सा धा सा धा पा धा पा धा पा धा पा सा धा पा धा पा धनी धा धा पा धा पा बा धा पा धा पा धनी सा निसरे निस सरे 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 निसरे धप धनी सा दीज आर द मॉड्युलेटर्स एंड डी मॉड्युलेटर्स दट हेल्प्स अस टू अंडरस्टैंड और फर्दर मोर सॉरी अबाउट दैट Furthermore, differentiate between that earthly and spiritually existent bodies. Why rishis and munis, or why 
Vedic texts are talking about this earthly and spiritually existence and non-existence or the non-existent bodies. What what is that one need, right? You may ask, is it that exceptional individuals like Ravana Maharshi, Swami Vivekananda, Ramakrishna Paramahamsa, Shirdi Sai Baba, Shankaracharya, Madhvacharya, to name a few, you whom you can count on fingers, have understood that differentiation of earthly and spiritual nature. And this is where actually like you know, wherein I was giving introduction to cosmic consciousness and center of cosmic consciousness in unity with the whole and uh, transcendence and intuitive and metaphysical existence and portal to spiritual world and of, uh, uh, perception of time and uh, reality in cross reference to this this time travel which I am talking about is it that you are talking to, uh, that we need to differentiate between this earthly existence of the human body that is there in this world at terrestrial level and at a spiritual level which goes over and above black zone to infinity zone which is the ultimate reality wherein you don't find any reality or the non-reality element there everything is unified even that gender variation also is not there over there masculine masculinity or femininity also is not there yes absolutely and this is a reason why at a earthly base at a earthly state this human body which is having 65 billion neurons use these saptaswaras or use these mantras manana trayate iti mantraha by deciphering the very shloka of brahma satyam jagat mithya that brahman consciousness or the reality of the brahman consciousness and that illusionary world so called uh, illusionary world or jagat mithya aspect Brahmaiva, that Brahman, Jeeva Naparaha, that Brahman who, have, who has created that universe is, has created this earthly beings also. We need to differentiate between this earthly existence of the human body from the reality and unreality perspective and this is where the intuition, intuity and the metaphysical existence reference point view point, uh, reference point of view comes. understand this and thus getting us to the center of cosmic consciousness this is what is called Nada Bindu Kala 
Nada Bindu Kala also the same. Nada Bindu Kala is nothing but that aspect of differentiation between earthly existence of the human existence, humanoid as a whole. which has a very complex structure of body, mind and soul wherein mind plays a key role and that energy is released through Agnya Chakra understand this ladies and gentlemen You know, when you are not able to distinguish or when you are not able to understand that uh, context of this, then this human existence does not have any value at all. To explain this cryptic subject wherein to find the differentiation between this uh, earthly existence and the spiritual existence being two different visions of the human existence or the commonalities is what Natya Shastra's text is all about from the Apaurishaya point of view I do not want to get into those chapters or I do not want to get into that uh, Chatur Vedas Rig Veda, Yajur Veda, Atharan Veda and Sam Veda. Today the modern day psychology, what you call this psychology and neurology and spirituality or philosophy, they, are, they have come up with various uh, explanations and uh, various uh, notations and uh, they have given their own perceptions though here Tarka and Vitarka aspect also comes into picture again everything is depend uh, everything ha for everything there is one common point the modulator and demodulator aspect is the Sabdaswaras. It is a very huge challenge for the researchers in the field of musicology and uh, vocalists or you know in the fine arts culture. To this day, there are many research happening. Research scholars have uh, uh, written various uh, white papers on this. But I would say that, you know, maybe this point is that one uh, which is missing actually. Due to which maybe we are not able to get to that uh, proper understanding or the exact understanding of the consciousness nature or that consciousness definition to give you an example I have been to Shirdi for 21 days I was in Varkamai and my experience was really blissful which is unexplainable when I went to Tiruvannamalai
you know that connection of the meditation yoga drashta and yoga drushya aspect which i was talking in my previous video right started happening and i could feel those vibrations and in ram krishna math when i go and i directly sit face to face facing ramakrishna paramahamsa's uh, sculpture or if i go face to face with mother goddess ma kali i get those vibrations i can feel that difference of earthly existence of ramachandra as a whole and spiritual existence of ramachandra it took me almost around 3 uh, decades ladies and gentlemen today i am 49 maybe i ha- i have started at my 14th year my journey so to understand this very phenomena right you need to experience both of these visions the earthly vision and the spiritual vision of the human existence how is it then that earthly vision can be understood through the femininity and that's where the mother's role or stree's role comes into picture and that is the reason why i am consistent consistently telling we have been abusing this feminine form that right breast which gives the malnourishment to the baby till the fifth year gives that strength to understand this that this earthly existence is divine in itself and it needs to get that uh, supernatural power that power to withhold the left breast of the mother gives that nature nature understanding natural understanding gives that broader overview and tells my dear kids my dear kid see understand this this is what is the nature understand the positivity of the nature the two eyes of mother which are so divine that you know you can't really have that face to face uh, a talk with that mother kali i am telling you don't even ever try to do that because the kind of energy that is emitted when you talk to mother kali directly face to face if you are able to communicate with her which only ramakrishna paramahamsa did because he had that pure mindset absolute pure mindset i know what kind of energy that comes when you are directly having that face to face talk with that mother goddess or the mother kali even now the subject that i am talking it is my direct conversation with that mother goddess i am talking to her face to face and she is giving me that knowledge base downpouring that knowledge base and i am giving you that this is what is called this earthly 
existence or the earthly you know connection that i am connecting with her and she is giving me that spirituality knowledge spiritual knowledge downpouring that spiritual knowledge with that intuition which is coming through my third eye which is there in the agnya chakra and the moment i am telling this right you may ask how exactly you are trying to be outside also like bahir mukha she has she is giving me that innate knowledge think about it ladies and gentlemen absolutely this is what happens in a classical dance form understand this and this is why the natya shastra again was introduced to show the dancer as a dancer who is dancing to show these two visions this earthly existence and spiritual vision to the audience sitting up who are watching there the distinct divine vision how exactly this forms when that transformation of the thoughts that is realigning and reengineering of the thoughts start happening at a conscious level here in the mind wherein you have 65 billion neurons that get us connected to that 100 billion uh, galaxies and again how do you get this when you do that travel of time and space whether it is 5 minutes of recital or 2 minutes of recital or 5 minutes or of, of uh, your meditational practice or yoga practice 5 or 10 minutes or 1 hour or 2 hours whatever it is that's when the actions and experiences start happening these actions and experience start happening at the in right and left brain wherein they start activating and thus that vision starts you know uh, coming out as an output from this agnya chakra and it goes to these two eyes and this two eyes give that output think about it ladies and gentlemen and what is that modulator and demodulator aspect that gets us connected sapta swara second as i was explaining think about it ladies and gentlemen that's i conclude this video with a positive note stay blessed have a blissful life may the guru's grace be with you all have a nice day ahead